The U.S. stocks, they're trading positive this Monday afternoon to start off the new trading week. This following positive momentum out of Europe as investors look ahead to a week filled with Fed speeches as well as economic reports. Now ahead of this Friday's important jobs report for the month of April, factory orders for the month of March showing a gain of 2.1 percent. That's the biggest increase in eight months and above expectations calling for an increase by 1.9 percent. At the same time, the U.S. dollar remaining on the upside against its counterparts. The euro dollar 0.35 percent lower at a read of 111.59. The British pound U.S. dollar pair is 0.11 percent lower at 151.21, while the U.S. dollar Japanese yen pair that's 0.01 percent lower at a read of 120.18 yen. Meanwhile, the U.S. dollar Canadian dollar pair that's what's in focus as the pair has broken below a rising trend line and also below the support at 121. Short positions below the resistance at 122.15 are favored with targets at 120.50 and 119.90 in extension. Also, precious metals, they are on the upside. Gold in focus as gold's relative strength index is above a descending trend line. The 20-hour moving average is well directed, so as long as 1176.50 is the new support, look for further upside to 1199 and even 120750 in extension. And silver, that's 2.82% higher at a read of $16.59 to Troy Ounce. And don't forget to follow Trading Central on Twitter for all of your Forex market updates. And for Trading Central Web TV, from the floor of the New York Stock Exchange, I'm James Swinney.